Hello, and I'm here to talk about deception in advertising. Deception is, is when one person tries to trick another person, or in our case, when advertisers try to trick you into buying things. There are loads of deception in advertising. For example, have you ever seen those commercials with perfect food? Well, it's actually inedible things that look great on TV. Did you know that those commercials, that delicious looking roast chicken, actually just raw chicken stuffed with newspaper and potato mash, then they spray paint the golden brown look onto it and put it on camera? Look, looks great on TV, but not that edible though. Mind blowing, isn't it? <laughs> People in these kind of industries also use promotions from those new movies and films, such as the second a new Star Wars or My Little Pony movies come out, they put it on chips, bags, and soup cans with names like Jedi Brunch or Unicorn Sparkle Chips. <laughs> and they also do things like buy this today for a chance to win an awesome prize. And they put these extremely cheap toys in cereal boxes to deceive parents into thinking it's a win-win. Parents are deceived into thinking that not only do they get food for their child, but also a toy to play with. So fast, fast food places do similar things though. Unlike the cereal boxes, the toys they put with their meals are completely unrelated. Such fast food places put these Pokemon toys with their meals. Why do they do that? Does it mean Pokemon made it or it's made from Pokemon meat? Please explain it to me. <laughs> and fast food places also continuously repeat ads over and over and over. Now, time to now that's over, it's time to talk about deception and toy advertising. Have you ever seen those commercials with a really catchy theme tune and kids having so much fun that sends children running to the pound screaming, can I have it, please, please, pretty please? <coughs> well, that happens in commercials only and rarely ever happens in real life. Advertisers tend to animate the toys and edit the video to make it look as cool and attracting as possible. Talking about that, I also got deceived when I was smaller. I was watching TV when I saw this really cool commercial, so naturally I rushed my pants to the toy shop and bought it. But when I came home to play with it, it didn't do, it did n nothing the commercial told me and broke really easily. I was extremely disappointed and upset. And, talking about it, toys, things like the hottest trends today were originally made a long time ago. Such as Pokemon cards, which is trading cards like every other card made. Advertisers also tend to shape toys around popular things like the new stars move and call it the Jedi Blaster or Pilot's Rifle. To attract the fans to buy it. Now in our conclusion, I say that we should always do our research or read the small print before buying something, because if you don't, you'll probably be deceived out of your money. Thank you for listening. <laughs> <laughs>